Hey, this is Sean Sandridge coming to you on this gloomy Monday morning here in Northwest Indiana, Chicago. And I'm here with a motivational Monday. I haven't done one of these in a long time. So I want to talk about being still and being quiet. And so many times we have to deal with things that are chaotic in our lives, some things that are put upon us that causes chaos, and some things that we do that creates chaos. And in that chaotic time of a crisis, so many times we look to other people, whether it's talking about the issue, uh, trying to kind of bend someone's ear, uh, even complaining about the issue, and we seek to so many people for validation of our feelings and sometimes we just want to throw up for a, a, a for lack of a better word just kind of throw up what we are thinking about on other people warranted or not and if you are in a situation where there is chaos going on and there's a personal crisis going on, I would suggest you be quiet and be still. Because while you're busy seeking validation or advice or talking to so many people about your situation, sometimes the best thing to do is to just sit down and be still and be quiet and listen to the two important voices, which is your own in silence and your higher power. Because in the stillness and in the silence, many times we will get our answer. We will get our conviction. We will get our correction. But you have to sit and be still because so many times we will do things or things will come upon us and we already know the course of action we should take. We already know what we've done wrong or we already know what our position is in the situation. And so instead of looking outside for the answer, sometimes you need to go within and first seek your heart, seek where you are in your intentions and be still. I really hope that this message has helped somebody today. And trust and believe if I have said a motivational Monday message to you, I am not only talking to whoever is listening to this, but I'm also taking my own advice. And the message today is to be still and to be in silence and reflect on the situation, your part in it. And then after that, when you come to the conclusion, sometimes it's just best to just leave it where it's at. Once you get your answer.